relying on the case it was contended by the learned counsel for the appellant that there is a presumption that parents will be able to exercise good care in the welfare of their children it was argued by the learned counsel on behalf of respondents that the impugned order warrants no interference before passing the impugned order the learned judge had spent over 1 hour with the children to ascertain their preferences the children have been living with the respondents since their mother's death in june 2006 as the high court had stayed the order of the family court vacating the injunction order while the respondents had been complying with the visitation rights granted to the appellant the children were not happy with the treatment meted out to them during the time they spent with their father and stepmother in contrast respondent number 3 contrary to the apprehensions expressed by the appellant has stated on record that she had no intention to marry and would devote her life towards the welfare of the children respondents further asserted that the cited cases are not applicable to the facts of this case para we have heard the learned counsel for both the parties and examined the impugned order of the high court and also the orders passed by the family court after considering the materials on record and the impugned order we are of the view that at this stage the respondent should be given interim custody of the minor children till the disposal of the proceedings filed under section 7 9 and 17 of the act section 12 of the act empowers courts to make such order for the temporary custody and protection of the person or property of the minor as it thinks proper in matters of custody as well settled by judicial precedents welfare of the children is the sole and single yardstick by which the court shall assess the comparative merit of the parties contesting for custody this court had observed in this decision that custody orders by this nature can never be final however before a change is made it must be proved to be in the paramount interest of the children in that decision while granting interim custody to the father as against the maternal grandparents this court held that the decision bench appears to have lost sight of the factual position